part of the challenge in developing a very diverse design team is you know, finding, well, a diverse population of, of people who are, have got the skills and the training to bring into GM design. And, and CCS is a great school. It's just incredible school right here in Detroit. And I really, I highly recommend it. And their population of students wasn't as diverse as I thought it should be, or they thought it should be. And, and so working with the president of the university, we developed a program working with the Detroit Public Schools. It's only been around for five years and it's building and we're, and it's growing and, and there are young people from Detroit Public Schools who have now received scholarships to go to CCS. And so it's building and I, I really like what is happening there. I happen to be on, I'm on the board at CCS now. Um, Howard University is a key institution with General Motors and, and I am, uh, I lead our efforts there at Howard University and we have a team that met with that team earlier today, you know, on some of the things we're planning to continue to build the relationship between Howard University and General Motors, not just from a design perspective, although we, we do recruit from their School of Fine Arts, but um, their School of Business, you know, and uh, their School of Engineering as well. You know, you really have to go into a field that, that you feel passionate about. You know, don't go into design because it's this new hot thing or, you know, it's kind of the rock and roll, you know, uh, kind of a deal. Go into a field that you're really passionate about, that you're hungry for. That's where you need to go. And you do it for the love of developing, designing cars, or your love for engine, developing engines and tinkering with, with things mechanical, or your interest in politics, or your interest in whatever field. That's what you need to do. Go where your passion is, not because you think you're gonna make a lot of money in this field or in that one, you know. Uh, that's what's so important. That being the case, you need to create a vision. You need to create a plan. Don't just think, you know, boom, I'm going to go become a car designer, you know, tomorrow. You, know, you need to plan. You need to, you, need to, you need to create a vision no matter what you're doing, whether it's planning your career or planning the design of, the, you know, of a vehicle. You need a very clear vision if you want to be successful. Thank mm -hmm. you.